wish we could get through a video without me looking like a bum. The PB2, like, we did a lot. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I'm doing a face mask on my face. I just, um, I just got out of the shower and I did a, like, I exfoliated my skin. And I was thinking in the shower about green juice and like what really makes me feel good and like what foods I eat and like things I do and like the way I move my body that makes me feel good. Um, and so I thought I would just share that with you guys tomorrow. Um, so I started this video tonight because obviously like showering and exfoliating and moisturizing my skin makes me feel really good. Um, so yeah, we're starting with our night routine and then we'll wake up and go throughout the day and just eat things that make me feel good in a healthy way because obviously Oreos make me feel good too. Um, but yeah, we're on our health kick. It's a, it's a lifestyle. So yeah, I will see you guys in the morning. Okay, good morning. Um, I'm up. I had to do some posting and stuff. I made a really cute reel for this coffee company. Um, and I'll put it in a video. I don't know if it's going to be this video or a video that you guys would have already seen by now. Probably that. Um, but the video is so cute and the coffee is bomb. But anyway, so we're doing... Let me calm down. So we're doing a video of eating things and doing things that make me feel good, healthy things. Okay, so this is my new obsession. If you guys have seen my Instagram, I love these, okay? Clearly. And I have another flavor too. So right here, we have passion fruit. We've got watermelon and acai berry. I think watermelon is my new favorite. Don't tell strawberry because I have a huge bag of strawberry from Costco. So I'm gonna go with a watermelon this morning. And I like to drink this on the way to the gym as well. So I'm like super hydrated. Actually, I'll drink some of this in the car and then I'll drink like half of a Alani New or a Celsius. You guys know I love those as well. Um, none of this is sponsored. This is just stuff that I love, like genuinely. Actually, honestly, you guys, if it's anything that I tell you guys about, it's something that I love. So I wouldn't just be like, hey, let me just show them this and it's nasty or not good for you or whatever the case may be. So yeah, anything you guys see me promote on my channel for you guys and have a link for you guys, it's something that I actually love. Um, and if it turns out something that I don't actually love after like a long run, I will come back and report back to you guys. Because um, I want you guys to have all the facts, you know? Okay, so I'm gonna have this in the car. This one is really sweet. I should probably add some more water to this one. Um, and then I have half of this one. I feel like this is old. So let's open a new one today. Let's go with this one. This is raspberry acai green tea. I've never had this one. This Celsius before. Yummy. So we're gonna go with these two drinks on our merry way to the gym. I will record my workout in the gym and show you guys as much of it as I can. And then I'm gonna go get some stuff so I can do my hair. Um, I'm a little nervous about it. I'm not exactly sure what I wanna do to it yet, um, but like this color isn't working. So we're gonna try something. <laughs> okay, so let's go to the gym. Hi guys, we are back from the gym. Today's workout was amazing. I forgot my stand at home, so I wasn't able to record anything, which was kind of nice um, because I record pretty much every workout that I do. So it was kind of nice to just like do my workout and not worry about like trying to get like clips of it and stuff. Um, but yeah, I did take pictures though when I got home um, just now. And yeah, so if you guys aren't following me on Instagram, make sure you guys go do that to see the pictures. I can show you guys some like right now. Let me find a cute one where I'm smiling, looking strong, because I did upper body today. So, oh, the glare though is like terrible. There we go, you can kind of see. Maybe, okay, you get the picture. Um, so yeah, I have been working out. 
outside a lot. I look really tan right now. Um, and enjoying my bike and the park and everything. We know what happens, what's coming here soon. So I'm trying to be outside as much as I possibly can. Um, I got some supplies for my hair. Um, I'm really feeling a smoothie bowl. So I'm gonna have water and make a smoothie bowl with you guys when I get out of the shower. And yeah, we're just gonna fill this day with foods that make me feel really good. So I'm excited. All right, I started doing other things, typical Sarah. And I got really hungry, so I'm like, might as well just make it now. And then I can go sit outside and have my smoothie bowl. So I just have like um, really ripe bananas in here that I froze. And I'm about to do the same thing with these ones sitting right here because they're really ripe. And you don't throw away ripe bananas, you just don't. They're just too good for smoothies. So I've got like about this much in there. Once again, you guys know I'm terrible with measurements. I've got these organic mangoes from Costco. I love these. These are my favorite um, after the Trader Joe's mangoes. I just think that they do a really good job of making sure that they are ripe before they freeze them, cut them, pick them, cut them, and freeze them. I've had a batch from Whole Foods that the mangoes were like completely white and I was highly disappointed. Um, next thing, I'm gonna do this acai packet. I showed you guys these before. Um, I just do the ones that are um, no sugar added because it's not necessary. When you add all this like really sweet, ripe fruit. And then, ooh, that's cold. Um, I have frozen spinach as well. So I'm gonna add this in there, which gives it that like kind of an ugly color, but that's okay. Cause it's about the nutrients, right? Ah. Okay, we're losing spinach. Okay. And then next thing is just gonna be the liquids. I'm gonna add in a little bit of this. I can't believe I still have this left. Just a tiny bit of this. And a tiny bit of this. And I don't want this to be too thick, but it's probably gonna be really thick. Let's add another splash of that. Um, and as soon as I go outside, we know that it's gonna melt. So, this is what she looks like, and we're just gonna blend her up. I guess I'll get the blender and bring it over here so that you guys can see. The kitchen is a mess currently. I need to fix that though because I have a recipe video to record for you guys and I hate when the kitchen looks a mess, period. But I hate when the kitchen looks a mess and I'm trying to record something for you guys. So that's an absolute no. <laughs> Spoiler alert, it's good. So, what do I wanna add on top? Definitely some PB2. That's like one of my faves. I just take a huge heap of PB2. Like this. Put it in a little tiny bowl with I'll show you, like this much. And I squirt some agave in there. And whoa, that was way too much water. Like way too much. Which is okay, we just add some more powder. And then mix, mix, mix. There we go. Okay, so now we're like, not as runny. Let's get something crunchy on there. Like 
I really wish I had some oats. I mean, some granola. That's what I need to do, make some granola. But I have these Rice Krispies. I'm just gonna add these on top. The ingredients are just rice, sugar, corn syrup, and salt. So, whoa. I like try to make this so pretty and it just turns out a mess. But it tastes good and that's all that matters, right? Okay. I'm gonna do Rice Krispies and we'll do some blueberries. Slippery little guys. All right, then we're gonna add some blueberries. I'm sorry you guys can't see. I'll show you guys when I'm done. And then the PB2. I think that's all I'm gonna add today. I don't wanna do too much. And then just the PB2 on the side. That's kind of a lot of PB2, but it's okay. And I'm gonna take the PB2 with me outside. Oh, please don't overflow. Okay. <laughs> Every time, I try to make it so cute and it's just not. The PB2, like we did a lot, it's okay though. But this is what it's looking like. I'm so excited to eat this, I'm so hungry. So let's go outside and eat this. I got some raisins and brought them outside too, just in case. You guys cannot see me. My mom was making mashed potatoes yesterday and she was like, do you want some? And I was like, eh. Long story short, she made them. I judged mine up the vegan way and they were so good so i'm thinking when i go back downstairs i'm gonna boil some potatoes because yesterday those were so good all right i have a lot left so i guess we'll see you guys later hi guys it's now like six i cut up the potatoes i'm gonna make mashed potatoes and either broccoli or a salad um, this lighting is driving me crazy. I really need to go get my stand. Um, but anyway, can you see me? Okay, so I'm getting, I was getting so hangry while I was cutting up those potatoes. So I, <laughs> eating some yogurt out of the container. Mm, I'm gonna wait for the water to boil and clean the kitchen because it's a mess. And then I need to record a video for tomorrow. Oh my gosh, there's stuff everywhere. I just peeled the potatoes and now there's little potato shreds everywhere. That's why I never shred potatoes. I, I am remembering now. So yeah, I haven't had anything else to eat. I feel like I should eat something else. There are some days where I'm so hungry. I don't know why now. There's some days where I'm so, so hungry, and the other days where I'm like, eh, food. And so, today was one of those days because I had that huge smoothie bowl, but now, and then I get hungry so fast, do not be like me, because when this happens, and like you have drunk food sitting around your house, this is when you fall into that trap, like, oh my gosh, I was so hungry. So I just grabbed like whatever. Um, luckily for me, my whatever is usually okay um but yeah now i'm hungry so while the water heats up i need to clean my room but i really want to clean the kitchen because i want to record that video so i can get it up tomorrow 
it shouldn't take that long. Um, by the time you guys see this video, you will see that one, hopefully. Um, but if not, I don't want to tell you guys what it is yet in case I don't get it up because technical difficulties or whatever, so. Yeah. So this is the yogurt that I'm having right now. I just had a little bit, honestly. Um, and it's made out of soy milk. It has corn, corn to starch, live cultures, no oil. So I love having this. I need the cultures. Ladies, if you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. Either that or I have some kombucha in there. I like to have, if I don't have that in my diet, um, <clears throat> if you know, you know. So I always either have yogurt on hand or kombucha for those purposes. Um... Yeah, so I don't think I want to eat anything else. If I do, I will definitely show you guys. I might have like a little tiny bowl of yogurt and raisins and like the Rice Krispies. I might, but I kind of feel okay right now enough to clean up a little bit uh, because it's driving me crazy. I don't know about you guys, but like when my space is a mess, like my brain is a mess. Um, and so like my room right now is... Um, so yeah, I need to get that done and then we'll get back to the food because I'm so excited about these mashed potatoes and yeah. <laughs> I'm not being a very good example so I am coming on here to correct myself. I've got my chore robe on <laughs> and I'm going to make myself some oatmeal. I'm going to show you guys how I've been doing it lately. It's so easy. It's instant oats. I don't measure anything because who does that? Um, I put about this much in there and this is a huge bowl. And then I put a lot of water because I prefer mine on the runnier side rather than the like chunky side because I feel like it gets like caught in my throat. You know that feeling? It's just like, it's just, it doesn't, that's not good to me. So, okay, so it looks like this without me tipping it completely over. And then I do like about a minute 30. The water is almost boiling. We're looking a little stiff. So I'm just gonna add a splash of almond milk. I'm all over the place today, you guys. I'm so sorry tired and my life is insane <laughs> so I'm trying I need to go get my stand so that you guys can see what I'm doing but I just mixed it up with the milk in there and then I usually add either this brown sugar I showed you guys in my last video brown sugar or this cane sugar but the agave is right here or you can add maple syrup, it doesn't matter. I do probably like a tablespoon and a half or so. And then I'll put some blueberries on top and call it a day. Super simple and super easy. Um, and then tonight I'll just make sure I have a huge salad. <laughs> Not every meal I do a 50-50 plate It's just like sometimes it just doesn't work out like that or like maybe I'm really cold and I don't want to have a um, like a cold salad or if I don't want to um, heat up like broccoli or something heat up broccoli or something I don't know if you can hear me <laughs> um, so yeah the water is making a lot of noise but like it's not boiling I'm confused so yeah I'm gonna have this clean up the kitchen and I'll let you guys know what's going on with the potatoes but it's boring I'm just gonna boil them and then I'll show you guys the fun part mm. so good so simple let's get to cleaning there's so many dishes like it's just me I don't understand how this happens these are clean over here and then like, I just, I don't get it. I don't get it. Okay guys, I have boiled the potatoes. I strained them and I put them in this lovely container. Oh no, I'm missing something. Okay, I'm missing 
Okay, the kitchen is clean. I feel so much better. So the first ingredient I'm gonna add is this almond milk. I'm gonna add more than I did yesterday. Guys, I'm so sorry. I do not have any measurements for this. It's kind of like a, <laughs> a Sarah original. I just kind of add stuff until I think that it's enough. Next ingredient, we're gonna add nutritional yeast. I have it on, open on the big side because I'm making a whole bunch. This is what makes it like really cheesy and delicious. And then yesterday I did garlic salt, but I wanted to show you this seasoning salt from Trader Joe's. I used to use this all the time. Whoa, but I feel like I just, I wanna go for like a really simple um, t flavor like how I did yesterday, hello. There we go, okay. So we're just gonna do a little bit of the salt. Every Whenever I do salt, I like to pour it in my hand first so I know how much is coming out. And then pepper, of course, is my fave. And then I forgot I had <clears throat> this thing, <coughs> this thing, this thing. I don't even know, a masher, sure. And then we're just gonna mash everything together. It's lacking the flavor department, so I'm just gonna add a little bit more of everything. I wish we could get through a video without me looking like a bum <laughs> at some point. But. I guess it's not for today. So I just added more milk, more salt. I'm gonna not add any more pepper because I can like feel it in my nose right now. More nutritional yeast. Nutritional yeast, yeast never hurt nobody. And I am currently steaming some broccoli right now. I thought I was gonna go for a salad, but eh. Okay. Mm-hmm. So good. So. Here's my broccoli. I haven't had broccoli in like, I don't even know, like over a month. I used to eat it with every single meal. And I've been into green beans lately and now I'm over them kind of, so. Yeah, here we are again with the broccoli. And that ha that's how it goes too, like I eat something until I'm so sick of it and then we circle to something else and then circle back around. So yeah, dinner is almost ready. Okay guys, I have just finished recording a recipe Friday for you guys. So if you guys haven't checked out that video, make sure you go do that. Um, I made dessert and it's really good um dinner's done i didn't have any broccoli yet and i've been moving around what i need to do right now is drink some water and um i'm kind of like getting a bit of a headache which i never get i only get headaches when i don't drink enough water so what i'm gonna do is like put all this stuff away that i have out which isn't a lot because i pretty much cleaned everything as you can see back there um i think i'm gonna put some stuff away like in my bathroom and everything and then yeah put away my dessert because i don't need it yet um but yeah so i really didn't eat that much yet and i still have like one more thing to do and i, I think we'll like make this a two-day situation because i also wanted to show you guys um a new juice recipe that i want to try but i'm gonna try it together so and i love spending fridays with you guys so yeah we'll make this video another day and i think you guys like the longer video anyway so yeah, we'll stick around together. <laughs> that is a terrible angle, but recipe Friday is a go. I look so tired and crazy. Um, 
but recipe friday is a go i'm uploading it right now so make sure you guys check out that recipe i'll like link it up here somewhere um i'm really supposed to be doing my hair and like finishing some stuff for school i need to do um but like i really just have a headache right now because i haven't drank like a ton of water today i just chugged one of these these really cute cups we got from costco um that change color when they're cold this is my second one um i might have a liquid iv that will probably help me um but yeah i have a headache currently it's 10 o'clock i feel like i shouldn't start my hair right now but I also am like the biggest night owl and I want my hair done. So, the only person that's gonna do it is Moa. So, I'll come back with a report, I guess. Maybe I should eat something and then drink the liquid IV and maybe I'll feel better. Or I'll just do my hair tomorrow, I don't know. I'll come back with a full report. crazy but happy friday i'm getting ready to do my hair i just made a juice i'm so excited i really like kale juice don't sleep on kale um i have no idea what's in there because i made two different ones but i'm pretty sure it's kale celery green apple and i just put some lime juice at the end and some ice it's very good I, I really wish I could have this every morning. I feel like it wakes me up more than coffee. Like, I feel like I am like ready, rearing and ready to go. But like, we can't rear and ready to go like this. So, um, I'm gonna handle this. Pray for me. Hi guys. It's like five or something. Look at me. There's no watch on my hand. Um, hold on. Um, that did not help at all. Let me see. That's better. So I did my hair. You guys will see a little later because I have to fix some pieces. Like, what the heck is this? But anyway, um, so I have been neglecting you guys all day because I've been trying to do my hair. Um, it's almost done. I just need to make some tweaks to it. This is my cute little fit for today. I'll put the pictures. They're from, they're on my Instagram already. Um. But yes, yeah, so I had a green juice and then I had a Go Macro Bar. You guys know that like when I'm doing something, I tend to not eat, um, which isn't good at all. I'm just like very like focused on the task at hand and I don't want to stop and eat because I think that it will, not I think, it will stop me from like what I'm doing and like finishing what I'm doing. Um, so I made broccoli and mashed potatoes yesterday which you guys saw and i also had that for dinner i don't think i picked up the camera last night i slept on the floor <laughs> because i didn't shower because i thought i was gonna do my hair and so i was like you can't get in the bed and it's too cold out here to sleep on the couch i'm rambling so right now i'm starving so i'm gonna have some more broccoli and mashed potatoes um and yeah i did want to talk to you guys about something while i played this up i wanted to talk to you guys about and like how I feel so you guys know I've cut out like pasta and like as much bread and stuff as I possibly can um, but I feel like I don't feel as lean as I did when I ate all of those things and I was trying to figure out why I'm like what am I doing and honestly it's because I'm struggling with like finding foods to eat that I enjoy um, and so like I find that I just like don't eat or like eat a little bit of something instead of eating enough um, and that's like never good for weight loss either. Um, so yeah, you don't want to starve yourself. So I feel like I'm struggling with that. And I thought that would be 
you know I like share everything with you guys about like my weight loss and like, losing my last 10 pounds or whatever like so yeah I just wanted to share that it's been a struggle and I like there's a feeling when you feel like really lean and you know you're eating really well um and that's just a feeling I want, you know? It's not a weight, it's not a look, it's a feeling. And I think that that's really important. Like, you know you're eating as good as you can, you know you're exercising, you know you're staying hydrated, and like, that's just, you know what I mean? That's just, you feel good. And so I've been struggling with that. Eating potatoes and stuff makes me feel really full, and eating greens makes me feel really full. Um, making green juice makes me feel really energized. Like right now, I could go for a coffee, but like when did I make that green juice? Like really early this morning. Um, so yeah, I feel like I could go for a coffee only because I enjoy the taste of it. Um, so actually I might have one. Yeah, I'm gonna make an iced coffee right now and I'm gonna heat this up and I'll show you guys what it all looks like when I'm done. are warm broccoli is warm iced coffee is here it's only 5:58, so i'll be fine it's friday i think i told you guys that so i mean i'm not really worried about staying up too late um and yeah i'm very excited about drinking this coffee I just, I don't think that I enjoy like how it makes me feel anymore because I know that like my green juice does it better, um, but I really enjoy the flavor. As weird as that is, it's just like almost like a comforting flavor at this point. So yeah. Maybe I'll put in some clips of me dyeing my hair because it's kind of funny and I was like freaking out. But like, but yeah. Say hello to the curls. They are back in full effect. Hopefully they'll be even better when I finish my hair today. Um, It's really nice outside, so I'm gonna go upstairs and sit on the front porch in a rocking chair and enjoy my food. I knew that. As soon as I got it up here, I'll bite into a cold spot. I just finished my iced coffee. I'm watching a vlog. Um, am I the only one that does that? It's actually so annoying, but I have to get everything out, you know? Um, <clears throat> but anyway, my mom just got me some Oreos from the store. So I'm thinking I might go get some of those. Billy's mad at me because we always hang out. Let me go get him before he freaks out. Yeah, hi. He's getting his hair cut in four days. I'm so excited. I'm sure he's excited too, because he definitely needs it. And he's gotta be hot. This poor guy has had this long hair all summer. But the vets, the vet, the like PetSmart or wherever he goes, um, they were all booked up. So, yeah, he's finally getting his hair cut. I was talking about Oreos. My hair looks insane. Just don't look at it. I'm telling you guys, one of these days, I'm gonna get all dressed up for you. One of these days. Today is not that day. <laughs> Hi guys, I am back. I had to go on a like mini road trip. My mom got me Oreos. Like I told you guys earlier, don't mind my hair. I was just playing with it and I think I know what I want to do with it. But I don't know like if it's going to be high maintenance or not. Slash, I don't even know if I can do it. Um, but anyway, I'm going to have some Oreos. Probably four of them were being open and honest. I need to have more water for the day as well um, before I get into my like zone of fixing my hair. This lighting in this room is so bad. Oh, that's better. Okay. Wow. So this is, I need to get some sleep. 
Okay, I'm gonna have these Oreos. I'm so excited and I need to fix this. I'm like really proud of the color minus these sections here, but like, look at that. It's, uh, looks like I paid for that. This side, struggling a bit, but we're gonna fix it. All right, y'all, I finished my hair. I am obsessed with it. I need to finish my actual hair video I'm making of it, um, but so far I like it. We'll see how it looks like completely when it dries, but for this video, I need to clean up my room at least a little bit tonight, so I'm gonna do that right now because it looks like a disaster. Like I told you, I slept on the floor and then like things are just like all over the place. So I'm gonna fix up my room a little bit. Okay guys, so I have grabbed some more potatoes and broccoli in this bowl here. Um, earlier I had those Oreos and I made myself a liquid IV and um, just grabbed some water. So I'm probably just gonna like watch a show or something tonight. I have my juice ready for um, tomorrow morning. I'm very excited about that. I need to go get some more celery from the store because that's celery and kale and lime, I feel like that's my jam. Celery, kale, lime, maybe cucumber is so good. Um, I thought I would really only, not really only, but I would really enjoy the ones with fruit in it. Um, but today I just had so much energy from the green juice. I still will be drinking smoothies because I like, I like the fiber and I know that like fiber is something that's um, necessary in your diet and I can get a lot of fiber from the fruit from a smoothie um, but I really do enjoy a morning green juice it's kind of my jam um, so yeah I'm gonna end this evening if something fun happens tomorrow then I'll show you guys but I don't know I don't want to make the vlog too long um, but I have been eating things that I really enjoy in this vlog and I'm very excited about that I want to say like I don't know how I feel about going back to pasta and stuff Mm. I still eat a lot of rice and potatoes, which is delicious. Like these are so good. So, yeah. Yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Hi guys. I always say that I'm gonna come in here and like have on makeup and not look crazy for once. So here we are. Um, I just finished my hair. I have a video, I don't know what video is gonna be out first, but I just um, did highlights on my hair. It was a whole process. Glad it's over, but I'm also glad I did it myself. It saved me like $300. Mm. Just now finishing my juice. That one wasn't as good. It had watermelon in it and Cucumber, kale, I don't. I really don't know what was in there. Whatever was on the little table thing yesterday, like random things got thrown in there. Um, so it is a beautiful day out today. I'm really feeling like I want either oatmeal or pancakes, something sweet this morning. Actually, this afternoon currently, it's 12, 16. Um, so I guess I will take you along. I don't know if I wanna end it here or what. I don't even know how many days we've been going at this point. I wanted this video to be about eating things and doing things that make me feel my best. Um, so I showed you guys like green juices and eating oats and lots of fresh fruit and mashed potatoes with um, like really good seasoning and greens um, and those things truly make me feel my best um, I did tell you guys a little bit about how I struggle with like eating enough and then like overeating like a little bit later it's never like back to back it's like I'll go a couple of days where it's like hmm I didn't really eat that much and then like the next couple of days I'm like I'm so hungry um, I just need to get better at like when I'm doing a task I need to like either bring the food like to me or give myself like some time to take a break to eat um but you know that's just life um and things that i'll just have to work out i think i'm gonna end this video here you guys got to see like i said all that to say you guys saw me do things or eat things that make me feel my best but also like having my hair done and like having a cute gym outfit on or like doing my nails like those things make a difference 
and my mental health my physical health all that stuff it like makes a difference like when you feel confident about yourself in your own skin in your own hair in your own nails like you feel better and you're more you're confident you pre you present yourself to the world differently like when you feel really confident about yourself so yeah i guess i just wanted to um take you along for that um now that i'm babble 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 again um but yeah so thank you guys for watching so much and i'll see you guys in my next video bye <laughs>